our membership is diverse. It includes Democrats. It includes Republicans. Gasp! <laughs> it includes independents. It includes men. It includes women. It includes people who believe that we can do better in this country and that we can reduce gun violence in this country. Diverse, awesome U.S. House. So H.R. 8 is a background check bill. And it's not a new background check bill, really. It simply intends to update the background check bill that was introduced 25 years ago before the internet. Okay, now who can argue with that? Polls indicate, all kinds of polls indicate that over 90% of Americans think that if you own a gun that you should have had a background check. How many of you think that if somebody buys a gun that they have had a background check? Raise your hand. All right, so you all know better. <laughs> Actually, 25% of guns are bought with no background check. Are you surprised? Well, there are some loopholes. So right now, private internet sales are not subject to a background check. There are several states that have introduced this, but wouldn't it be great if we could introduce this in the entire country? So HR8 is a bill that you need to be looking for. It's in the US House. If you live here, your U.S. representative, you know who he is, call, right? If you know that you are not allowed to buy a gun because you're a convicted felon and you walk into a gun shop and you try to, and you don't pass the background check, that information should be shared with local law enforcement officials. We need to get rid of the preemption law in Florida that kind of ties the hands of our local uh, government officials from passing any meaningful gun violence prevention legislation. We need to regulate 3D printed guns. We need to get rid of concealed carry reciprocity. And we need to get rid of stand your ground. Stand your ground started in Florida and it's, it's dangerous. None of these are things that are controversial. They're common sense things that everybody can agree on. Join us. Text READY to 64433. It's time to roll up your sleeves and please help us make a difference. Thank you.